is done. Huh? Yeah. You can see all the designs there, all printing and all that, patik printed, huh? all that. All those, huh? also for sale. Huh? If you want, you can buy it and bring it and hang it in the house. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay. There are three systems of how to make bucket patik. One, to use chanting, and he's doing. Put the wax inside here. Wax. Huh? This is resin to, to make it uh, stick. And it draws the design. Okay. So with chanting, this is called chanting. With this, uh, there is no one same design. Mm. All uh, fabric will be different, different design. Is it freehand? Use hand. This is use no, hand. Freehand drawing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There. He's doing it. He's showing you. This is how you do it. He's an expert already because every day he's here doing it. <laughs> we try, we cannot because our hand shake. <laughs> okay, he's an expert. All right, this is how it's been done. Okay, this is chanting, uh, using chanting. The other one, use block. This is machine made block. Okay, this is a uh, later part. This is an older way of doing it. This is later part. They use the machine to make the designs. Okay, they put, put the wax, take it out, pop, 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 pop. All same design. Okay, alright. The other one is a uh, silk screen printing. Huh? Silk screen printing, they don't show here. Huh? Okay, this is how he does. After outlining the design, he just paints the dye. You know? After painting all the dyes, the whole thing is soaked into boiling water. Then the wax will melt away, but the outline will be there. The design outline will be there. Okay? Mm. Beautiful, isn't it? <coughs> huh? See? He is doing like block printing. <laughs> all the same. <laughs> The fabric can be silk, can be cotton, and various other materials. Eh? But normally cotton is the best. Mine is not cotton. This is our batik. This is our official uh, attire for riding. Okay, come, let's go.